In today's video, we will check how expensive is Nepal for tourists. We will explore the costs for travelers from getting into Nepal, accommodation, dining, transportation, sightseeing, and more. You can enter Nepal either by air or by land through India or China. There are three international airports in Nepal, including Tribhuvan International Airport in Kathmandu. This airport is the primary gateway to the country. Travelers can either find direct flight to Nepal or can find connecting flights with layovers in hubs like Dubai, Doha, Abu Dhabi, Istanbul, Singapore, Kuala Lumpur, Delhi, Mumbai, or Bangkok. The prices vary depending on your location, date, and the airline you choose, which may fluctuate. When planning your journey, it's important to check visa requirements, any additional travel restrictions, or guidelines. All travelers to Nepal require a visa to enter the country. For a 15-day tourist visa, the cost is US $30, and for a 30-day visa, it's US $50 and US $125 for 90-day visa. These visas allow for single or multiple entries, giving you the flexibility to explore different regions of Nepal. If you're planning to extend your stay in Nepal, you have the option to extend your tourist visa. For a fee of US $45, you can extend your visa for an additional 15 days. After the initial 15 days, each additional day requires an extra payment of $3. US Tourists traveling to Nepal can obtain a visa upon arrival at Tribhuvan International Airport in Kathmandu. However, you can get visa beforehand from Nepalese consulate general or embassies in your country. When it comes to accommodation, there are range of options to suit every budget. You can find accommodation for as low as 500 Nepali rupees, which is equivalent to 4 US dollars. You will be amazed to discover that, in Nepal for less than 65 US dollars, you can experience a level of luxurious accommodation, which is very rare in other parts of the world. If you are budget traveler and enjoy meeting fellow travelers, consider Staying at dormitory rooms. You can get dormitory rooms at prices as low as Nepali rupee 525, which is equivalent to 4 US dollars per night for single occupancy. And for double occupancy at Nepali rupee 1050, equivalent to 8 US dollars. For more privacy, comfort, and amenities, there are mid range hotels typically range from US $10 to US $50 per night. You will have private bathroom, air conditioning, double bed, or single large bed. If you are seeking the ultimate luxury experience, Nepal has extravagant suites available. It starts from $80 US per night. When it comes to food, Nepal offers a range of affordable options. For budget travelers, local street food and small restaurants are an excellent choice, with meals ranging from $2 to $5. If you prefer mid-range restaurants, you can expect to spend around $5 to $15 per meal. And for those seeking fine dining experiences, high-end restaurants offer a variety of cuisines starting from $15 per meal. Traditional momos, steamed or fried dumplings filled with vegetables or meat, are a must-try, and it costs around 100 to 200 Nepalese rupees for a plate. That is 76 cents to US $1.50. 
At local restaurants, you can enjoy a plate of dal bhat, which includes lentil soup, rice, and an assortment of curries. The average price for a meal like this is around 400 to 600 Nepali rupees. This is equivalent to $3 US to $4 US dollars. Local beer costs about $4 a bottle and coke at around 70 cents. Restaurants in commercial and tourist-centric areas tend to have higher prices, often at least double the charges compared to those in regular locations. Nepal is home to several UNESCO World Heritage Sites, and visiting them is a must. There are temples, monasteries, museums, caves, lakes, and lot more. Entry fees for these UNESCO World Heritage Sites typically range from $3 to $10 per site. Entry fees for temples, monasteries typically starts from 38 cents. Typically, the entry fees will always be less than 10 US dollars and even lesser for tourists from South Asian region. You can get information about entry fees from official website of Nepal Tourism Board, the National Tourism Organization of Nepal. Getting around Nepal is an adventure in itself. Local buses are an economical option, with prices ranging from 20 cents to US to dollars for short distances. Within this price, you can travel from one part of city to another, and even travel nearby cities. These buses get crowded during peak hours. For exploring inner areas of cities through narrow alleys, rickshaws are preferable. While the standard fare is less than $1, rickshaw drivers may charge tourists up to $2. Remember to negotiate politely and agree on a fair price in advance. For more comfortable and private mode of transport, taxis are readily available in Nepal cities. Local trips within cities or to nearby destinations can range from US $3 to US $10, depending on the distance. Look for meter taxis or negotiate the fare before starting the ride. If you're planning to explore different regions of Nepal, far from capital city, domestic flights are a convenient choice. Flight prices can vary from US $50 to US $200, depending on your destination and the season. For long-distance travel you can also try tourist buses. For a comfortable and hassle-free journey, tourist buses are a great option. They offer scheduled departures, cleanliness, and more amenities. Tourist buses typically charge between $10 to $25, depending on the distance and the level of comfort provided. To travel within Kathmandu Valley, you can try ride-hailing apps, named Pathau and Indriver, similar to Uber. These apps provide reasonable and cheaper prices for your transportation needs, allowing you to navigate the city at your convenience. Nepal is world famous destination for trekkers. To go on a trek you will need trekking permit from local authorities. Trekking permit price starts from US $20 per person for a week and it goes on up to US $500. To know more about pricing, you can visit this official website of Nepal Immigration Department. We hope this video makes you easier to plan your budget to travel Nepal. If you like our work then don't forget to like, share and subscribe our YouTube channel.